This is a quick unboxing review of the Ishin VR009 goggles. So let's open the box and see what we're getting inside. Inside we get the goggles, there is no built-in battery so you have to connect your own to, to full cells battery. The screen size is 5 inch and the screen resolution is 800 by 418, it's 16 by 9 aspect radio, ratio. The goggles came without any instruction manual but this is pretty self-explanatory so I'm gonna hook it up and show you all the options. Uh, the antenna connection is SMA. And let's see what else. This is the video in, you have video out, and you have audio jack. Getting two foam pieces. The head strap comes separated. There is a place on the back where you can put your battery. We're getting also this mushroom antenna, X2, XT60 adapter. So we just plug it here. You can connect your LiPo battery and there is also adapter for video adapter so you can use it if you have a different kind of uh, adapter. It says that the video is 17 millimeter. If the external socket is 14 millimeter length, please connect with the transfer cord. Okay, I'm not going to test it. What I'm going to do, I'm going to turn it on and check the video quality. Once you plug the XT60 connector, the battery, it just automatically turns on. Let's just find the right band. In order to find the correct band, what you have to do, hold the M in the middle, the, and it will just stop when it finds the correct band. And actually the video quality is pretty impressive. The screen is really sharp. You can see that this is not bad at all actually for this price. Probably it will give it the best value for money. But maybe I recommend to add extra 30 bucks to get the Ishin VR D2, which I have reviewed as well because they have built in DVR and also a diversity receiver this is just one antenna but still maybe you can find a good deal uh, and buy this one so as you can see the screen quality is pretty good and if you're debating where to get these goggles or the VR008 go for the VR009 they will, they will give you better value for money and the screen quality is much much better so without a doubt get this one if you're debating between those two the main downside that I find is that there is no diversity receiver inside and also there is no uh, built-in battery so you will have to connect your own battery so maybe some people will find it useful just to use their own battery. Anyway, these goggles cannot be used with while wearing glasses so take it into consideration as well but actually if your prescription is not that strong you are not going to need them. So thank you for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, goodbye.